found an old 1998 Westwood ride-on lawnmower and we're going to make it into a race mower. Alright guys, so we're down at Madman Mechanics. You all know that we're well known for doing our super quad builds and Raptor conversions, all that sort of thing. But like in our downtime, lunch times, I spoke with the lads and we decided we want to do something a little bit different, a little bit fun, just something for ourselves. And to show you guys as well what we're capable of, what we can do, pretty much turn our hands to anything. So what we've done, we found an old 1998 Westwood Ride-On lawnmower. This thing has been sitting out in someone's yard for years, it's rusty. It is a shed, but us being us, we've looked at it and thought, yeah, well, we can do something with that. So we've gone and picked that up and we're going to make it into a race mower. We're going to fabricate the whole thing to accept a 700 quad engine. We're going to put suspension on it. We're going to put some nice wheels on it. We'll powder coat all custom graphics. And the good thing is the lawnmower that I found is road legal. So you're going to see us pulling up to car meets. We're going to be out on the road. Let's see what we can do. I'm going to go and show you the mower now and I'm going to show you what we're going to do with it. Yeah, we've gone and done it and we've got the Westwood and we're going to convert it. Ready? Hey. So the grass cutter is now off. I don't think they're taking it in, Joe. What do you reckon? Alright guys, so we've got the Westwood mower fully stripped down now. All the cutting gear's gone off it. Well, everything's gone off it, as you can see. And looking at the chassis, it ain't man enough for what we want to do, or what we're trying to do. So we're going to go now back in the workshop. We're going to fabricate a frame up to accept the Raptor engine. And then obviously we're going to utilize all the mower stuff back onto that chassis with some quad stuff. Like we're going to put some suspension on it. We're going to widen the back. And yeah, we'll see where we end up. All right, so there's all the stuff we've took off it basically. It's just stuff we ain't going to use. I mean, look at that pea shear exhaust. We ain't using that, man. All right, guys, so we're down at Madman Mechanics. We're getting this mower build on the way. So the next job is to get the engine prepared. We've got a lot of stock here at Madman Mechanics. So we've got engines, we've got stock A-arms, we've got stock axles. Anyone need any bits, just hit me up in the DMs. So I've gone down to our stores. I've got a stock Raptor 700 engine, and this is what we're gonna be using in that Westwood mower. So we're gonna stealth it all out. We'll take all the cases off. We'll paint the block black, new gasket set. While we've got it open, I might put a high compression piston and a cam in it, just cause we can. I'll do all the cases, carbon, and like I said, the block will be black. Put it all back together and I'll keep you updated on the progress and we'll get it in the mower. Right guys, so the cases have now been stripped off the engine. I've been and sandblasted them all and they're all ready now to get a coat of paint and then I'll dip them in the carbon. I'll show you the progress. Right, so like I said, the mower build, I'm going to be utilizing a lot of the parts from the Raptor 700s. So the next thing I need now is a swing arm. So I'm going to go down to my stores, grab a swing arm, and I'm going to work on magic with it. I'll show you what I've done with it after. So yeah, I'll take this swing arm now. I'll go get this ready. I'll get the bearings out of it. And I'm going to, I'm probably going to powder coat this black and I'm going to put our Madman Mechanics logo there, airbrushed on. So yeah, I'll get this done and I'll show you what it's saying. Alright guys, 
guys, the swing arm is all ready for the mower now. So I've done that in a gloss black and I've added our logo onto the back of it. So that'll go on the mower now, nice little addition. And yeah, we'll crack on with some more bits. So we just powder coated the mower frame and done it in a gloss black. So we're gonna have a look at it now and see what it's saying. Alright guys, we've got the Westwood all laid out on the floor now. We're pretty much ready to start the build up. So as you can see we've made a whole new chassis. That's all been powder coated now, ready to accept the engine, which we've also blacked out, done a few bits on there, carbon cases, stuff like that. We've hydro dipped the A-arms, we've fabricated all the steering stem and all them sorts of things there. It's all laid out, ready to go. We've also picked out a nice set of alloy wheels. We've powder coated those black, put the tires back on. We've hydro dipped a carbon axle. We've had to make a custom fuel tank for this. Joe's made that, we've had that powder coated as well. Um, calipers we've done in red. We're literally just waiting for the shocks to come out of the oven. We've done them in red as well. So as we start to build it up, I'll show you a little bit more along the way. So obviously with the build being what it is, trying to make it into a race mower, we did want to use the original chassis, but with how far we've taken it, we took a look at it and we decided we'd make our own chassis. So with that being done, we've also made um, all the throttle and the brakes. It's pretty much like a car. We're gonna have the throttle on the right, brake on the left, and we'll have the shifter doing the gears like on a handle. So we've fabricated all the gear levers up and the brake pedal. We've made all these on the lathe, made the spacers up, so everything's pretty much ready to go. It ain't gonna be long now, this will be together. You know what, I'm really looking forward to ripping this down the road. This is gonna be some fun, I can't wait. up on the bench we're now ready to put the engine in we're not going to bore you too much showing you putting nuts and bolts in all that sort of thing all right guys so that's it engine's now in the frame that went smoothly no problems there we're now going to carry on put the front hardware on the rear hardware on and get this thing built up and on the floor
but that's it. The back end of the mower is now on, complete. And as you can see, I think it's looking quite good. The red is popping. We've got the carbon axle on. We've got the wavy disc. The hubs are on. Everything's powder coated. It's all looking good. We're getting there now. So as you can see, the mower build is really taking shape now. We've been very busy here this morning. I've been down there powder coating, getting the shed and all that ready to go on. Adam's been up here, he's got the brakes on, they're all bled, the lines are run. 
He's done the throttle, the brake, all of that's all working. The oil tank's in, it's all been plumbed in with AN fittings. He's also managed to get the fuel tank in place. That's all in and plumbed in. We're looking very good. We're gonna go now and put the loom on, and yeah. Alright guys, so as you see the Westwood mower is now pretty much complete, nearly ready to hit the streets. We've just got the front hood to put on and apply some graphics and then I think we'll be pretty much there. So as I said previously, this is road legal, so we've got our F1 LED light pack installed onto it. 
integrated indicators. We've also found an OMP steering wheel we've put on. Just got to clean it up a little bit, but that'll do the job. Just waiting for the seat to come back as well. And yeah, you'll see it tearing up the streets. Guys, so it's that time now. I'm about to apply the graphics to the mower build. So originally it had these very old Westwood graphics planted all over it, as you've seen previously in the video. So now, as you can see, I've made the sticker pack up. We've gone like the original, put our Madman Mechanics logo on it, and incorporated it with the Westwood Gazelle. So as you can see, they're looking quite good. These are going to look really smart applied. So I'm going to go and get to it. I'm going to get that done. That's it, the mower build is complete. We're ready to hit the roads. So yeah, we've added a few final touches. We've done a custom Madman mechanic seat. That's looking hella nice as you can see. Uh, all the graphics are finished. I'm very pleased with how it's come out. Um, I'll just show you, so obviously the Raptor 700 is under here. We lift up the hood now. If you want to do any maintenance or anything like that, it's as it was on the mower, pop the hood, get to the engine. As you can see, we can turn our hand to pretty much anything at Madman Mechanics. Don't hesitate to get in contact. If you've got any crazy builds you want us to do or you're thinking about doing, get in contact and we'll see what we can do for you.